The new and improved book and Quacker Show, Scene 3 to 16, The Quacker's Christmas Carol, has been brought to you by One Tree Media. As you can see, the MP3 player didn't, won't work on here. So, anyway, let's do this thing. Okay. Merry Christmas, Scrooge! Ah, bah, how much to you? That wasn't very nice. Merry Christmas, Scrooge, and can I have my rice? No, I'm bought how much to you? Ah! Merry Christmas, Scrooge. Ah, bah, how much to you? Ah! Bah, how much to you? Ah! Even your cockaroni. Okay. And, uh, why did you say no on my raise? I really need my raise. I don't have that much money. And we need something for Christmas dinner, not turkey. We need something else. Ah. Uh, I'm not giving you a raise. Even for Christmas. Ah. Uh, you're such a Scrooge, Scrooge. Clatchet slams the door. Until... Scrooge, I'm going to go to the store and buy something. <laughs> okay, there we go. Okay. Until Scrooge goes up to the door and sees something strange on his door handle. Scrooge! Jacob Marley? Hmm, weird. <laughs> And then, ooh, Scrooge, Marley, what are you, what are you doing here? I'm going to tell you that you will be visited by none other than three spirits. Can you be more a little bit more descriptive? No, the three spirits will tell you names, and uh, if you don't succeed, you'll be in these chains and dead, like me. So, it's, it's those three spirits are bust. <laughs> hmm. That was very interesting. Hmm. Huh. Hmm. Well, I'm going to go back to sleep. <laughs> Scrooge. <laughs> Who woke me up? Hmm? Was it you? Yes, it was. Uh, I'm gonna throw you out of this window. No! How in the world did you go through me? I'm a ghost. You were a ghost? Ah! I'm a friendly ghost. Oh, okay. I'm, I'm in. I'm in. So, what's your business? I'm the ghost of Christmas past. Christmas past? You mean you're a time traveler? Exactly! Okay. So, you want to see your past? Wait, you can go back in time? Exactly! Oh, okay. You want to see your past? Of course. <sighs> ah, prom night. What a wonder to the world. Who wonders if you can get a girlfriend or not? Exactly. So, you're in love with the prettiest duck in the world. Hey, that's my calling. No, it's not. You thought she was the prettiest duck in the world. But she doesn't look like a duck. She looks like a dog. Her name was Isabel until you betrayed her. Actually, her name was always Isabel. Uh... She never saw you, nor do anything with you again. Except for the first thing you did was dance with her. The second thing was get married. The third thing was betray her. Hmm. Okay, we're not gonna see the wedding, right? Exactly. Oh, okay. Okay. So let's go a little bit further to the future. Hmm. Ah, what the... I am a respectable duck here. Mm, 28, 29, 30, 31. Why are you counting your gold, dear? Because gold is more important to me. Mm -hmm. 
She weeped and she weeped and she weeped. Exactly. Hey, that's what I say. Hey, you can't take my lines. Yes, I can and I will. <laughs> Guess he's lost his ankle. <laughs> okay, who's next? Oh, I'm the ghost of Christmas present. Christmas present? Wait, you mean we get to open presents? No, not exactly. Okay. So, uh, what is your business? The ghost of Christmas present, I just told you. Yes. So, uh, why are you doing this? Why am I here, exactly? Well, uh, because you don't believe in Christmas anymore. I used to. But not that much anymore. Exactly. So, you want to see somebody's house? Hot dog, I'm with ya! <sighs> this is Bob Cratchit's house. She was not very wealthy in the future. He is still not. But he will be not in the future. So, anyway, what the... There's plenty more to eat than that! That, that small turkey and small piece... Why do they have to eat small stuff? Because they're poor. Exactly. So, well, what's boiling in the oven there? No, uh, actually, that's your laundry. Uh, oh, yeah. How did you know? I have my ways. Wait, you're not Santa Claus. Exactly. There's plenty more to eat. No, that's your laundry, actually. Oh yeah, how did you know? I have my ways. Wait a minute, you're not Santa Claus. Exactly. Oh yeah, so anyway. Um. Hmm. But we must wait for Tiny Tim. Coming. What's wrong with him? Unfortunately, he has a very severe illness that I cannot speak of. Actually, I don't even know what the heck is that name. I forget. Ah, nuts. <laughs> I keep forgetting that name! Actually, I know what it affects. It affects it, a person's muscles. Muscles? You mean like... You mean Alzheimer's, right? Yes, Alzheimer's. <gasps> I remember now! He has Alzheimer's! It affects your muscles, right? Exactly! So... If he doesn't get well soon, he might... He might. I can't say it. You have to say it, Scrooge. Hey, where where did he go? You mean what happened to Tim in the future? I mean, who he? Mm -mm. <laughs> who are you? Are you the ghost of Christmas future? Uh huh. So, uh, I have another question. Why are we at the county cemetery? Because something horrible happened here. A funeral. A funeral? Actually, two funerals. What was the second? I can't tell you. Oh. So what was the first? Let's just say... It was somebody with Alzheimer's disease. <gasps> You don't mean! Oh, yes, I mean. Tiny Tim. Where's the grave? I gotta see! Ow! Oh, no! Please just tell me this can be changed! Uh, it can, unless you believe in Christmas. What, this whole thing without Christmas the whole time? <laughs> Wait, just a second. Ow! Ouch! You broke my cigarette. Well, actually, I have another one. Why? What? Are you... Why do you smoke cigarettes? I don't know, it's just for fun. You really beat the work, aren't you? Exactly. Uh... Hmm. Um... 
Well. Hmm. Hey, who are those two? <laughs> we won't be seeing him at night time soon. Um. Oh, we won't because he's a Scrooge. <laughs> That gives you to a hint of what the second funeral was. Hmm. Must be one of my family members. Hmm. That doesn't look like a family member of mine. It looks like... Me? Why me? Because you died. Because somebody killed you because you didn't care about Christmas anymore. That's the whole point of this thing! Really? That's the whole point? Exactly! So get in the grave. No! I want to stay alive! You can't. Somebody has to kill you first. <laughs> and who kills me? I do! What? You betrayed me this whole time and you're gonna... <laughs> hey, will you excuse me for a second? <laughs> That really, that really, that guy really has some issues. Issues? Issues? You really think I... I'm a cracker. I'm crackers. Actually, I'm Scrooge as cra crackers as Scrooge. Well, anyway, I can solve people with itches, actually. People can solve me with itches, okay? Oh, yeah, I saw your show before. It's very bad. Very bad! Very bad! My first episode had 32 views on it. That's pretty bad. What? A thousand views is the code. We gotta go. We gotta go. Well, okay, let's go to the doctor at 37. That was pretty good, actually. Okay, again, the grave. Oh, change! I believe in Christmas! Wait! Wait! Am I dead? No! It's Christmas morning! I still can have a chance! The spirits gave me a chance! Hey guys! Here's, uh, one good coin for you. Thanks, Scrooge. That's not enough? Well, I'll give you 20 coins! Still not enough! 50! Still not enough? Here, 100 gold coins! Thanks, uh... One... 171 coins for you. Ha ha ha. Uncle Scrooge, what are you doing? I thought you didn't care about Christmas anymore. Well, what you say? I'm coming to your dinner party. You will? Oh, thanks, Scrooge. And here's a hate penny for you again. Oh, yay, I had three cents. Let's go to... Let's go find something that's worth two cents. Okay, that was worth a shot. So anyway. Um. Hmm. Maybe. Now to go to Cratchit's. Christmas, Christmas, Hamburg. You still don't care about Christmas? Hmm. Oh, I, I brought something for you guys. Toys. Yes, 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 toys. And. Bob. I'm making you my partner. I'm giving you a raise. <gasps> you will? Oh, thanks, Scrooge. Hey, hey, kids, let me tell you a story. Yay! Once, uh, twas the night before Christmas, and all in the house, not a creature was stirring, not even a mouse. Somebody was the... And the New Improvement Milk and Cracker Show, Season 3, Episode 16, A Cracker Goose Christmas Cow, has been brought to you by Nunchy Media. Okay, um, this, that's it. So, um, well, I'm going to say thank you for watching the New Improvement Milk and Cracker Show, and I hope to see you on the flip side. Weep! Okay, bye, thank you for watching. Bye!